Hello and welcome everybody to another room 2 online battle with the Prussian Prince. Yeah. So this is a kink and I am playing against the Macedonian player. I'm actually Epirus. Well not Epirus, but uh I see me. Epirus was last game. Let's see what uh, we can actually do here. Um, Alright, gonna turn skirmishing mode off here. Could actually split up my army. Let's let's try that. Gonna control G to make a locked group, different from uh, the previous goal working. Just press G and it would be locked group immediately. Just a small little change there. I don't know if it's good or, or not. People have different preferences. So for some people they might like it, others may not like it. But yep, I'm ready. Gotta tell them I'm ready. Rider. Riders, look at my units. They look pretty nice. Well, they would look with higher graphics settings, but uh, still. Graphics of this game, they aren't terrible, they're okay, but they're not what they were supposed to be from what I've seen. They're supposed to look much better, but anyway, just waiting for my opponent to get ready. He is ready, or at least he just said hi, I don't know if that means he's ready or not. But, oh well. We will see if he's ready or if he's not ready. Alright, so battle has started. He's actually brought a few Rhodian slingers and four shield bearers, four royal peltists. So the salient cab, interesting choice by our opponent here. Even though Iceni isn't our Virni, we have still pretty strong cab and pretty strong infantry. It's not the best barbarian faction, but yeah, normally you'd see either Swebi or uh, Swebi or Arvirni. Arvirni just because of their super how super strong they are, and Swebi because of Berserkers or Longbow Hunters. Don't normally see Iceni. I would say that that's probably because chariots aren't very useful right now. That might be one of the things about uh, Iceni that doesn't really make them too viable right now competitive multiplayer but yeah you can see me moving up my army over here he's seems to have everything in one huge group and that's how he's moving it or something it means that he is totally out of position these guys are hidden but I, if I get some nice charges over here I could take his slingers out that's what, that's what I'm worried about not really about his cab Although I would like to destroy his cab too. Is he even noticing though? If he charges his cab straight into my cab, it's gonna die. Wait, he hasn't noticed yet. Oh, finally he has, but took him a while. Of course, I don't want to engage over here because I'm engaging with his. Uh, while he's got support, which could kill me. I need to engage when I have my royal noble riders or something. These guys, they have to stick in here. There we go. Ooh, what is he doing though? I could get some charges in on his Rodian Slingers. There we go. Quick reload. Quick reload. Target a Javelin Man. Target. Oh, that could be a nice charge. I'm gonna get everything. Well, not everything, but at least some of his units. Get there! Come on, guys. Ooh. We can actually take down our control groups. And look, so much of his units, so many of them are actually dying off here. Yep, you can see that I am trying to kite back. I'm not gonna engage him. Right now, I'm still trying to get superior positioning and everything. That those units are dying pretty nicely here. 
I don't even think I would need Swordmaster assistance. And now that his cav is just dead, there is actually nothing he can he can do. Thankfully for me, obviously. I could do a back charge over there just to make sure that he can do nothing. Now these guys here. It's the other way. Oh, one of his mercenary Romeo Slingers came back. Actually gonna go directly after it with my gen. Oh look, I need to target those javelin men. Right now it seems. I'm gonna move my guys all the way over there. Actually should I target those javelin men? Because I'm gonna get a nice little charge onto them. Oh, these guys. You know what? I could stop them down. One unit while the rest just do their best here. And that unit is, however, gone. I could keep targeting him. Rather, I should target that huge blob. Just make sure to wear him down and then I can take care of the rest. His Rodian Slinger is dead, thankfully. Oh, this unit of uh, Cav did come back though. Salian cab. Oh. I can start the flanking procedure. And I can do quick reload on some of them. Or not. That's okay. Here comes the flank attack. Moving my gen all the way over here. I could do a little. Uh, oh, I forgot to do. I guess I can do shield wall over here. I can do a back charge, but. After that, I will not be able to pull out. It's very interesting how he actually blobbed up his forces, though. Don't know why he would do that, but I guess he did that. Force frenzy, everything to even shield the wall. Why not? And here comes the charge. Just gonna get them as quickly as I can. Here comes the charge. Another charge. I'm gonna send everything. You know what? Yeah, they're just totally surrounded. Wow, this blob it's here is making me lag so much, but I can't believe how surrounded they are. <laughs> it's impossible to be surrounded more than this. So here comes the another cap charge. See how well it does. Another quick reload here. Yeah, my slingers are not doing too terribly for themselves. Not the best slingers though, obviously. But here go down all his real peltas without doing too too much. Some of his units, yeah, one of them got quite a few kills, but surrounded they will not be able to do much, as you can see here. Yeah, I'm getting a ton of kills with my heroic riders and even my general has got a lot of kills. But if you zoom in here, even though the graphics aren't maxed out, they're like medium high. Like the game still lags a huge amount, <laughs> as you can clearly see there. It's hard to zoom in on uh, what's going on over there. But yeah, his forces are surrounded. Just used Raise Banner and uh, the other one. Raise Banner, as you can see, it's pretty cool because it increases the defense of my units. Really like that. Soul Army is gonna chain route right now. Not sure what he was actually trying to do with this, but yeah, there goes this whole army right now. I'm gonna select all my missile units and it's finished. Not actually sure what he was doing with in this battle. Hmm. Quite strange. Yeah, decisive victory. Let us see the statistics. Yeah, he just blobbed up too much and moved in one huge group and that was his demise. As you can see here. But anyway, hope you guys and girls enjoyed and if you want to see more, don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. See you next time.